I'm going to explain the solution to each of these problems using both methods. The first problem you tried was negative 4 minus negative 3. Let's first look at the zero pair method. I have negative 4 represented and I need to subtract negative 3. I have three negative tiles that I can take away, so in this case I don't actually have to add any zero pairs. I can remove those three negative tiles and I'm left with negative 1. Using the add the opposite method, we would have negative 4 minus negative 3. We would change this to be adding the opposite. Now that it's addition, we can remove our addition sign, create zero pairs, remove them, and we have the answer of negative 1. The second subtraction problem you tried was 5 minus 7. Using our zero pairs method, we display 5 tiles, 5 positive integer tiles. This is showing us positive 5. Now we need to take away positive 7 and we don't have enough tiles. The only way of adding tiles in is by adding pairs that are equal to 0. So if we add in two zero pairs, then we have enough positive tiles in order to be able to take away positive seven. So I can remove five, six, seven positive tiles, and I'm left with negative two. Let's use the add the opposite method. We have five, minus seven. And I can change this to be adding the opposite, changing all of my positive integers to negative integers. And now I have five plus negative seven and I can remove this sign now that it's addition and create zero pairs. Until there are no zero pairs left to create. Remove my zero pairs and see that I am left with negative two. The last subtraction problem that you tried was negative two minus four. Let's first look at our zero pair method. Here we have negative 2. We need to subtract positive 4, but we don't have any positive integer tiles. So we need to add 0 pairs. Until we have enough tiles where we can take away 4 positive integer tiles. Now that I have four positive integer tiles I can remove, I'm going to subtract positive four, and I am left with negative six. The last subtraction problem you tried was negative two minus four. Using our zero pair method, we display negative two, and we don't have any positive integer tiles in order to be able to remove four positive integer tiles. So we have to add in some zero pairs. Now remember I'm not changing the amount that is represented with my tiles by adding zero pairs. Since these are all zero, we still here only have negative two. So now that I have added four zero pairs, I'm able to now subtract positive four, and I'm left with negative six. Now let's use our adding the opposite method. 
we have negative 2 minus 4. I'm going to change my subtraction to addition and then change the sign of the following number. So if I'm changing it to addition, I have to also change positive 4 to negative 4. I can now remove my addition sign and combine my tiles and I am left with negative 6.